Aloha, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, wherever in the world you're tuning in from. My name is Master Paul, and it's my honor to be connecting with you today on this live stream. I'm coming at you from Honolulu, Hawaii. It's about noon here in Hawaii. <clears throat> it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Doesn't get much more difficult to live in Hawaii, does it? But today I'm coming at you to connect with you on the subject of Tao Hands, to help you to better understand what is Tao Hands, how can it serve you, how can it awaken your soul, heart, mind, and body, what can it do to uh, benefit those that you care about, and how can you benefit from it? Because most of us, you know, we're looking at, you know, how can I fix myself first, and then I can maybe help fix others. And the beautiful thing about Tao Hands is it can help you to fix yourself. It can help you then to offer blessings to family members and loved ones. <clears throat> and you can then expand that to offer assistance, blessings, and more to others. And it's all about soul, mind, body alignment. We're going to go into that with far greater detail today. Everyone that attends will have an opportunity to receive a complimentary blessing today, a Tao Hands blessing. And when I have done these live streams in the past, uh, that's not something you want to miss. The Tao Hands blessings can be extraordinarily powerful. They can make a significant difference in your life. They are um, not to be scoffed at, let me put it that way. Those who have received the Tao Hands blessings typically have a measurable experience, let's put it that way. That's how powerful this blessing can be. Uh, so if you are unfamiliar with Tao Hands and you want to um, say, well, is that like Reiki or is that like something else? Well, that's why I encourage you to stick around and learn what the differences are because everything has its value and Tao Hands has its value <coughs> that uh, can be different in many ways from what you may be familiar with. So today's live stream will be very valuable. I will be focusing on the nature, power, and significance of this as well as I'll be focusing on the origination of it. How was it originated? Um, how long has it been here serving humanity? Uh, how you can attend and receive uh, significant Tao Hands blessings locally at the centers. Um, and then eventually if you choose to become a Tao Hands practitioner, how you can move towards that goal. That's what you can expect today. <clears throat> so I encourage you to share this video, let other people know about it. Um, I will uh, be, be um, hoping to bring a lot of people to a special uh, event that is coming up on the 20th, 21st of this month. And it is actually to receive blessings. Uh, it's a great opportunity. There are many of those that are in significant pain. Um, and it could be a physical pain. A lot of us have variations of that. My feet have had their... Uh, their little experiences most recently. I see some students that are joining that their levels of pain are 20 on a 10 scale. I know that because I've talked to them. <clears throat> and so we all have different levels of it. And so this is why it's a value to learn about this and to take advantage of it as much as possible. So I believe you're going to have some significant value. So let's check in, see who's joined us here today. Welcome, Allison. Welcome also to Alexander Quintana. Welcome, Carl. Aloha and welcome to Todd Stewart. Welcome also to Johnny Mambod. Aloha, welcome Sarah Jane. Welcome Kristen Rojas. Thank you Kristen for assisting me. Welcome Kristen Lafa, uh, Becky Lafave. Aloha to uh, Mary Miller. Welcome also to Carol Jaffe. And aloha and welcome to Don Robinson. Aloha and welcome to Angie Taylor. And welcome <coughs> Adam McGinn. Thank you all for coming. Thank you for clicking on the share button, letting other people know about today's live stream. So one of the ways in which Tao Hands can make a difference is to understand it. You know, a lot of us, we think we know about something. And um, there was a teaching that I received a long time ago through, um, it was like EST, or it was one of those organizations that basically take you down a two or three day path that, change your thinking and help you to see outside of the box that we like to see in. And one of their statements is, you, you don't know what you don't know. And that typically represents about 75 to 90 <laughs> percent. You know, we think we know, but it's what we don't know that we don't know that is really 
uh, where a lot of things can be gained. And so today I'll be talking quite a bit about that. I'll talk a little bit now about uh, a little bit of the history that's led me up to this. I have received this transmission, this treasure called Dao Hands. I received it uh, approximately five years ago. And last year um, it was upgraded. So it carries a much higher frequency of blessing opportunities. Personally, I've used it to offer financial blessings. I've used it to offer blessings to relationships. I've used it to offer blessings uh, for people to get jobs. I've used it to offer blessings, of course, for health issues, pain issues, uh, things like that. Um, I have offered the blessings on live streams like this about uh, probably about 10 times would be my, my guess. Um, each time with significant measurable results being posted by those who I asked to measure a before and I asked them to measure an after. What is your suffering before? What is your suffering after? And uh, there is, you know, 25, 30 people watching live at the times and, you know, no less than 10 people were saying, you know, I had this level of pain, you know, six, seven, eight, and now it's down to a one, two, three. That's pretty significant when you think about it. I'm sitting here in Honolulu, Hawaii, and uh, I'm 2,000 miles from the nearest person that's watching me on, on a live stream. And they're getting, not one person getting results, but seven, eight, nine, ten 10 people getting results. In fact, all 20 some odd people who are watching got a result, but some requested things that were not instantly measurable, such as they requested financial blessings, things like that. So all of these are possible depending on the person and what they're requesting, the length of the blessing and so forth. So welcome also to uh, Mary Mancuso, welcome Rosetta, welcome Anne-Marie Pierce, and aloha and welcome to uh, any other souls whose names I may have missed. Thank you for clicking on the share button and letting other people know about today's live stream. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to connect, I'm going to call forth all the beings of light, and then uh, we will chant the mantra of love, peace, and harmony, which connects us heart to heart, soul to soul. We'll let Facebook go out there and gather a few more souls so that we have a nice big group today and then I will go into this wisdom teaching and blessing. <clears throat> Aloha Deborah, thank you for coming. So dear all layers of the divine, the Tao, the source, our beloved creator, all the angels, healing angels, archangels, masters and ascended masters, gurus, lamas, kahunas, masters, ascended masters, Beloved Jesus, beloved Mother Mary, beloved Buddha, beloved Amitofu, beloved Kuan Yin, beloved Krishna, beloved Ganesha, beloved Muhammad, all beings of light, soul of beloved Mother Earth, the sun, the moon, the stars, planets, galaxies, and universes. We love you all, honor you all, respect you all. Ask you to come to please bless this practice, bless this service, awaken as many souls to humanity as possible, of the Tao hands, the power, their significance, and how they can make a difference in other people's lives. I'm very grateful for this opportunity. Dear the Source Soul Song of Love, Peace and Harmony, please turn on. Please, as we chant, bless us together, heart to heart, soul to soul. Clear blockages, open our hearts and our minds, and receive the blessing of the mantra. So for those that are new, this is a mantra. This is uh, translated in over 40 languages. And you can learn more at lovepeaceharmony.org. So I will now chant to serve you. You may chant along with me if you like. One round of love, peace, and harmony. Lula, lula, li. Lula, lula, la, li. Lula, lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. Lula, li, lula. Oh, I was in her ling. Oh, I turn and lay. Rung, ling, rung. Her musher shung. Shung, I ping on a sea. Xiang ai ping on he xie. I love my heart 
heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, <coughs> and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. Excuse me. How, how, how? Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, aloha and welcome to um, Isabel Rice. Aloha, welcome Deborah. Welcome also Danta. Welcome Josie Tequila. Aloha, Victor. No, I am not one of the psychics at this location you're talking about. <coughs> Excuse me. I do soul readings, but I don't consider that a psychic service so much. So thank you all for coming. Today's wisdom, teachings, and blessings is on the subject, the power, and the significance of Tao hands. The first thing I would really like you to understand is why Tao hands was brought to humanity to serve humanity. Uh, my teacher, Dr. Master Shah, is a world-renowned healer. I mean, literally, the world knows who he is. <clears throat> he has created hundreds, thousands, very likely millions, of miracle healings. They're only miracles because people do not understand it. When you understand it, it's not a miracle. Blessings were offered that cleared the spiritual debt. Spiritual debt is a negative, right? It creates a negative energy. You do bad, bad things to others, bad things happen. It's very simple. So if you have pain, <clears throat> pain has been caused upon others. I apologize about clearing my throat. If you have financial blockages, financial blockages were caused upon others. It's, it's a simple math. It's, it doesn't take rocket science to figure out why we suffer. Um, when we recognize that life has both positive and negative experiences and that we are responsible for them, then we can start fixing things. Very simple math. <clears throat> Master Shaw came to humanity to serve humanity. The wisdom that he brings is you can heal yourself. I can heal myself. We can help to heal humanity. When he uh, received very high level abilities to serve humanity, which is going all the way back to 2003. Prior to that, he was Qigong Master of the Year. Now, that's not an easy thing. In the 2002 World Congress, where there's literally 10,000 Qigong Masters, those are just the ones that showed up. He was Qigong Master of the Year. So to be recognized as one of the top, 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 top in Qigong, which is an energy art, <clears throat> is amazing. Soon after that, he received power directly from the source to serve humanity. That ability includes the ability to transmit power to others. Now, for example, if you uh, were a Reiki practitioner or if you've ever received the Reiki transmission, that is the form of a transmission that literally opens up channels through which frequency and power can come through to offer blessings to others. So this is nothing like Reiki, but the word transmission is along the same lines. Master Shah, as a dedicated servant to humanity, is a very high level spiritual being receive the authorities and abilities to transmit Tao hands to individuals. Now, in order for that to occur, the individual had to be purified enough. His uh, goal, his task, is to give as many people in humanity Tao hands abilities. Why? This is a very important question. A lot of people don't really understand why. Why was he tasked? to do this? Why was he given the authority to do this? <clears throat> if, if this was not meant, then it wouldn't be happening. Why, why is uh, the ability to transmit Tao hands being made available? Humanity needs healers. If you look around, humanity is suffering. We're moving towards the 30% mark on people having cancer. We are moving towards significant suffering in the emotional, mental areas significant depression, significant suicidal conditions. <clears throat> the teenagers are so messed up because their hearts are closed. They have so much um, misinformation coming at them from 20 different directions uh, that our entire world needs healing on a substantial level. Tao Hands works with the basic understanding that if there is suffering in anybody's life, anywhere on the planet, could be your children suffering, it could be you suffering, it could be your grandma or your mother and father suffering, it could be a coworker that you care about, it could be a spouse suffering. 
And that suffering could be emotional suffering, it could be financial suffering, it could be pain, physical suffering. <clears throat> it could be that they're suffering from a loss of a relationship or the loss of a loved one, maybe a loved one died. Suffering is rampant in humanity. What is not rampant is solutions. Psychology doesn't work that well. Drugs do not work that well. Covering it up with recreational drugs does not work that well. There's really nothing out there that works that well. Why does nothing out there <clears throat> that is being offered to us by modern uh, physical world society, why is it not working? The reason it's not working to any level that's measurable and effective is because it's not dealing with issues at the level of origination. The reason a person suffers is because of their virtue or their lack of virtue. What's another word for that? Their positive energy or their lack of positive energy. What's another word for that? Their good karma or their bad karma. The reason a person suffers is because of their good or unpleasant karma. It's very simple. <clears throat> Welcome, Joy. Thank you for coming. Welcome, everybody whose name I may have missed. Thank you for joining. Dao Hands addresses blockages at the source of origination. If you go to a psychologist, they're addressing it at the level of mind. If you go to a doctor, they're addressing it at the level of the, uh, the matter. They adjust the matter at the level of the cellular level, and that then creates an adjustment uh, of a chemical level. And so they try to chemically adjust your brain to deal with a depressive issue, for example. If you have pain, they will give you something that adjusts the matter so that it blocks the pain at the level of the matter. But matter is at the bottom of the scale. There is a scale. At the top is creator. At the bottom is matter. And in between, right above matter, you have energy. Energy is what moves the matter. That's why qigong, tai chi, acupuncture, and things like that work. We can't see why they put a needle in a certain part of our body, but over 5,000 years of wisdom, people with their third eyes wide open can see that there are energy channels that run through the body. Therefore, you put a needle in those spots and energy moves. When energy moves, the matter that is blocked causing the pain or the discomfort also has to move. When chi flows, matter moves. Okay, So energy is above matter. Well, what's above energy? What's above energy is the mind. Mind over matter, right? You've all heard that before. So the mind, you think and it follows. We think we're going to get a million dollars and it doesn't work. Oh, therefore mind over matter doesn't work. Well, that's a bunch of baloney, obviously. It's just that you are not reflecting what's up here at the top, above the mind, because that's what's inhibiting you getting a million dollars. <clears throat> mind over matter does work in certain circumstances, doesn't work in other circumstances. Mind over matter does move energy and it does move the matter. But what's above the mind? The heart. The heart is above the mind. This is the kind of advanced wisdom that most people fail to take any time to really understand. The heart needs to be open. Not the physical heart. The heart. Your soul's heart. When your soul's heart is open, what flows through? Source creator flows through. Source creator is positive energy, loving energy, the kind of good, virtuous energy that offsets negative bad things. Very simple math. When you do unpleasant things to others, unpleasant things happen to you. When you think unpleasant things about others, others think unpleasant things about you. When you do unpleasant actions, steal, cheat, hurt, lie, then these things come back to you. These kinds of sufferings come to us, physical, emotional, mental sufferings. So when we go through these blockages, we are accustomed to and taught to address them at the physical world level with drugs or with psychologists or with anything that the physical world brings to us. But the, our, but the, the source of the issue did not originate from the physical world. The source of the issue is our thoughts, our words, and our actions, our choices from this lifetime and other times that we or our ancestors brought into our world. <clears throat> Those choices created the experience that we have. If we address those at the level of origination, which is the level of soul, the level of where the blockages came from, 
then we can positively address them on a permanent level. Therefore, Tao Hands was brought to humanity to serve humanity at the level of soul. Raise the hands. How many of you have children? How many of you have mom and dads? How many of you have a husband or a wife or a significant other that you love, that you care about? When you try to fix them by taking them to the doctor or by taking them to the psychologist for their depression, when you try to fix them at the physical level with physical world things, you will have some success. Possibly be one of those that had great success. Congratulations. I hope it lasts. Sometimes it doesn't. And that's because the source of the problem is above what you're trying to address it with. Dao hands is heaven's hands transmitted to a human being. This is a very important statement. Reiki is heaven's energies transmitted to a human being. But Tao hands are very, very different. They're not, uh, there's no, um, one is better than the other. It's just different from the other. It's like saying, you know, McDonald's is better than Burger King. No, they're just different from each other. They both serve similar ways. The difference is that Tao hands releases good virtue. Tao hands releases positive energy. Good virtue is good karma. Good karma washes away negative energy or negative karma. Negative energy or negative karma is what is the source of any form of suffering. So when you look at the modalities that are out there, there's hundreds of energy modalities that are out there. Machines put out energies that offset frequencies. <clears throat> uh, human beings can hold their hands up and put out energies that, that put out positive energies and frequencies. And they have some effect, sometimes permanent, most of the time not so much. Why? Because the source of the problem is not directly addressed. Also, most of the energy modalities that are out there deal directly with physical pains, health-related sufferings. They rarely can go to balance... Uh, emotional-based sufferings, mental, mind-based sufferings, right? They rarely can affect anything of that nature, and certainly they don't affect anything but like opening the spiritual channels. Dao hands can affect all those. Energy-based blessings cannot affect finances. Dao hands blessings can affect finances. Energy-based blessings cannot affect a relationship, at least not that I've heard of. Uh, maybe you've come across some that have. Uh, but Tao hands can affect relationships. Energy blaze blessings cannot affect a business, any business success. Tao hands blessings can affect a business and business success. So all of these kinds of blessings are very, very positively affected when you have Tao hands. So how do you know if a pear is sweet? Well, you, first of all, you have to taste it. How do you know if Tao Hands works or if Tao Hands is for you? You must experience it. Now there is uh, this, not this weekend, but the following weekend, October 20th, 20th, 20th and 21st <clears throat> in the Honolulu, there is a two hour event happening. Two hours on Saturday, two hours on Sunday. They're separate events, so you can choose to go to one or the other or both. It's a very, very small honor fee. I don't, it's, it's nominal. For what the blessing you're getting, it's nominal. And it's literally to receive blessings. You might as well just, just get it for free. It's so cheap. Um, and Kristen will post the information on that. Right now, the links have not been generated yet to register. Right now, uh, the phone number is what will be posted for you. But you can call them and you can get your name on a list where they will let you know as soon as the registration links are made available. August 20 and 21st, two hours, you can attend one or both days. I highly recommend you attend both days because the amount of blessings and wisdom you'll receive is far, far, far more than the small honor fee they'll ask. <coughs> now, <coughs> during that time, you will have uh, not only some understanding of it, but the opportunity to receive multiple blessings. You can ask for the same thing or you can ask for different things each time. One of the things to understand, let me t pause a moment and acknowledge all those that have joined. So welcome Sharon Withers, welcome Paul Quackenbush, Aloha Divja, welcome also to Manju, welcome Nicola, welcome Victor, uh, welcome also to Gina, welcome Joy, 
Aloha and welcome Michelle, welcome Tina, Aloha Alicia, and welcome Rosetta. <coughs> so if I missed your name, forgive me. Welcome also to Shelly. So when you attend this two-hour focused Dao Hands, literally I think it's called Dao Hands for Healing Pain, I think it's what it's called. Um, and this again, it's October 20, two hours, October 21st, two hours. You can attend one or the other or both. And Kristen will post the information. Um, you're going to receive amazing results. So you, I'll give you an example today. It's amazing. So, give me a moment. Okay. I'm going to offer just a little more teaching and then we'll move into uh, a blessing. I'm going to do a blessing for one person only and then I'll do a blessing for all of you. Okay? <clears throat> and you can go ahead and state that you want to be one of those people, but only state something that is measurable on the physical body. I have this pain, it's this number, this is what it is. You know, it's my stomach, it's a 10 on a 10 scale. It's my, it's my, you know, a neck back pain, it's a 10 on a 10 scale, whatever it is. <clears throat> I'll do a one person example and then I'll give a blessing to everybody. Welcome Debbie and welcome Tammy. But you gotta tell me what you want and then I'll go back through and check them all and check guidance and pick one. <clears throat> but I'm gonna offer a little more teaching right now. If you just want to be a person who receives Tao Han's blessings, then attend the October 2021 uh, event that's happening in the Honolulu Center. You can call 808-988-8090, 808-988-8090. And they'll take down your name and they will um, make sure they send you the link as soon as they get that link set up. <clears throat> Don't tell me your pain without a number. I need to know where it's at, what the pain is, and the number. And if you have no pain, you're very blessed. So, why do we have suffering? In Master Shah's wisdom, he refers to it as soul, mind, body, misalignment. Now that sounds very vague. Soul, mind, body, misalignment. What does that mean? Soul, mind, body, misalignment. Soul, remember at the, just a little while ago I said, what's at the bottom? Matter. What's above matter? Energy. What's above energy? Mind. What's above mind? Heart. What's above the heart? Soul. Soul leads the heart. Heart leads the mind. Mind leads the energy. Energy leads the matter. One more time. Soul leads the heart. Heart leads the mind. Mind leads the energy. The energy leads the matter. Okay? So this is the order of things. <clears throat> Imagine a perfectly healthy body, pain-free, emotional no blockages, mind no blockages, financial no blockages, relationship no blockages, zero blockages on all levels. This body is in soul, mind, body alignment. The soul is leading the heart, the heart is wide open, the, soul, the, the person is, is following the soul's guidance. Therefore, there are no blockages. That soul is relatively karma-free. The heart then leads the mind, which directs the energy and matter to operate in peak efficiency. Soul, heart, mind, body alignment is what all of us are striving towards. When you have Tao hands, when you receive Tao hands, what's happening is your soul, heart, mind, and body are being aligned in that specific area. The, uh, the mind carries a message. The soul carries a message. I see pain in the hands. I see abdominal pain. I see gallbladder. I see a variety of things uh, popping up here. Feet pain. Um, <clears throat> why are these pains existing? Soul, heart, mind, and body are not aligned. Let me explain that a little bit deeper. Soul is the carrier of a message. What message is it carrying? The message is of a suffering that you or an ancestor may have caused upon another in a previous time. So if you have back pain and it's a 9 out of 10 scale, it's reasonable that you or an ancestor had created that suffering on others in a previous period of time. The message is that soul, which then 
creates a blockage in the heart, creates a blockage in the mind, creates a blockage in the energy and the matter. Therefore, you have spine pain. If you could see your soul along the spine, it would be a little bit dark. That darkness reflects the message of a negative choice, a negative uh, imbalance made at a time when you may not remember. Soul, mind, body alignment, which is what occurs when we offer Tao hands blessings, offers virtuous release. Releases blockages at the level of soul. Changes the message to one of love, one of positive energy. Debt is paid down. Virtue is offered. The, in this example, the spine, some of that uh, darkness is cleared. The heart then adjusts, opens, and more light comes in, healing light comes in. Then it opens and the mind says, ah, I can allow this healing energy to adjust the energy in the matter of the spine. And within two, three, five, ten minutes, sometimes even thirty minutes it takes, then that alignment occurs, so mind-body alignment, and the back pain disappears. One of the beautiful things about understanding soul mind body alignment is we are dealing with things at the level of origination. We are dealing with things at the level of soul. This is why humanity needs Tao hands at this time <clears throat> because there is so much suffering in all of humanity. If you were to move from beyond being the receiver of Tao hands to becoming a Tao hands practitioner, which it takes a couple of levels. In November, there is a, um, a soul mind body alignment course, which is not receiving Tao hands. It's the preceding course before you're allowed to receive Tao hands. Then that goes into much greater three days of training, wisdom, practices, and preparation to see if your soul, heart, mind, and body are aligned enough to receive the frequency that comes with the Tao hands. Because you have to have a, a cleared and higher level frequency to be able to receive that. You're, you're carrying a great deal of light when you become a Tao hands practitioner. So you don't want to be a cesspool of unpleasantness uh, before you receive it because it doesn't make for a very good delivery person and it can actually bring harm uh, if you're not ready to receive. That's how powerful Tao Hands is. So there are steps. The first is receiving the blessings. The second is preparing your soul, heart, mind, and body through the course of November. And then the third is to actually attend the Tao Hands retreat in person sometime after November. So let's go backwards some. Let's read some of these comments and then I'll check guidance and see you to offer the blessing too as an example. So Deborah Anderson uh, says it's an eight, but I don't see what her request was for. Maybe she says that later. Um, Michelle says feet, neuropathy, it's an eight. Uh, Michelle, pain in intestines. Divjot, pain on both thumbs, it's an eight right now. Shelly, uh, left growing area, it's a seven. Uh, Deborah Anderson, gallbladder 8 on a 10 scale. <clears throat> and Angie Taylor, uh, some pain in the feet lately. It's a 3 or a 4, not too bad. Uh, Nicola, it's a 9, feeling emotional pain, which is consuming her every day, exhaustion and pain in her heart and stomach. Delma says uh, she recently had dark blockages around her torso, feeling sluggish and low energy. Okay. And thank you, Kristen, for posting all the information on the Tao hands. <clears throat> so let me check guidance. Okay, so <clears throat> everyone will get a blessing after this, so don't worry, you're all going to get a blessing. But to make a point, I'm going to focus on a blessing for Michelle Taylor. So Michelle, can you please uh, state that you are still here? 
you need to see that you're saying, yes, I'm still here. She has a number eight on feet, feet pain, neuropathy. <clears throat> That's not an easy one. You know, neuropathy is very, very uncomfortable. You might get no movement on this blessing because it's, it's, a, it's a high level of blockage. But we'll try it. Heaven told me to, to offer a blessing there, so I'm going to follow Heaven's guidance. Okay, Michelle's present. So, <clears throat> one thing to be uh, important to understand is when you're receiving a Tao Hand's blessing, it's important to be open to receive, first of all, and to, from your heart, ask for forgiveness. Nothing is accidental. Any suffering that we have has a source. You know, my feet have been in pain the last uh, couple of weeks. I asked Kevin, I said, what's the source of this? And they told me, they said, uh, there was a lifetime when I bound women's feet in China. They, make the, they bind their feet and make their feet small on purpose, dainty feet. Uh, uh, then those women are considered special for sexual usage. I don't know what the whole deal was with, with dainty feet. But I was one of those that bound, you know, girls' feet, causing them great pain. And, uh, you know, so I have to do forgiveness practice around that. That was what I heard was the source of why my feet have been hurting lately. There is a reason for our suffering. So, uh, to receive the highest blessing, make sure you ask forgiveness, whatever the source. Okay? So, I will now offer this blessing. And I would just follow Heaven's guidance. It might be one minute, it might be five minutes, whatever Heaven tells me. Okay? Everybody else, <clears throat> um, just relax and receive. This, this blessing will only be for uh, Michelle, but you can attend and watch. Dao hands blessing as appropriate for Michelle Taylor for the condition of feet neuropathy as appropriate. It's always important to say as appropriate. Dao hands blessing. Start. Please continue to offer blessings. Michelle, please repeat this forgiveness practice while the Tao Hands continues to work. Repeat after me. Dear all souls, in this and all time, if I or my ancestors have created suffering in your life, especially creating suffering for your feet, legs, hips, any areas of your lower torso, that have caused you to suffer feet pain, toe pain. If I or my ancestors caused you to overburden yourself, if we had done anything painful or excruciating, there is no excuse for this lack of respect. We sincerely, I sincerely apologize. Please, please forgive me and my ancestors. Please receive the virtue being offered and release me of this spiritual debt. I deeply, deeply apologize. Will not make the same mistakes again. Dear Heaven, dear my beloved Divine Creator, please forgive me. I will do better. I promise to help others to be happier and healthier. 
thank you, thank you, thank you. Blessing continue. Thank you, thank you. <coughs> okay. <coughs> so you can let us know if there was any difference. Let us know what the number is now. The blessing will continue. Um, as is normal, just because I said halt doesn't mean that the energy and matter is not still adjusting. It still is. <coughs> and so we await for your response. And then I'll talk about it a little bit and then I'll offer everybody a blessing. So welcome, Julia. Welcome, Shannon Bellacourt. Welcome, Shara Papas. And aloha, Yvonne. So give me a number now, Michelle, as to uh, if there's any difference, what the number you would put on it. And, and be, be straight. If there's no difference, it's important to say no difference. If there is a difference, tell us what that number is now. Aloha, Carolyn Carroll. <coughs> Welcome, Peggy. And so for all those that have just tuned in, um, there is a dedicated two-hour time on the October 20th and October 21st and you can join via webinar it's a registration link that has it's not been created yet so you'll have to call and give your name to the Honolulu Master Shaw's Dow Healing Center and uh, Kristen Rojas has posted the contact information <coughs> excuse me and it's 808-988-8090 and it'll be two hours of dedicated time for receiving healing blessings so it's not a small thing. Um, I will offer everybody here a blessing again, but it won't be two hours worth, okay? So you may or may not get some benefits. But it'd be a great opportunity to understand a bit more about this. And I encourage everyone to register for the either the Saturday or the Sunday or both. <clears throat> okay, so, and I apologize about clearing my throat all the time. It's, uh, it's um, kind of irritating to me. I'm sure it's irritating to you. Pecky uh, asks for blessings in the head and gallbladder. So Michelle says that her neuropathy feet pain has went from an 8 down to a 3, about a 3. So that's about a 50%, 50 to 60% uh, shift in feet pain, in neuropathy pain. That's not insignificant. That's quite large. So congratulations on that. <coughs> Excuse me. Always, 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 we give our gratitude to heaven. We thank our beloved creator. We thank all the beings of light who offered their service. We thank uh, the Tao hands. And I thank my spiritual teacher, Master Shah, who's transmitted the Tao hands blessings to me. And I thank also, uh, important to thank Michelle, all the souls that have forgiven, very important as well. So with the next blessing, you can request the same thing, possibly get that number even lower. Now, before I offer a blessing to everybody, here's what I want everyone to understand. <clears throat> if you spend an entire lifetime financially taking advantage of people, then one blessing is not going to solve your financial problems. If you spent an entire lifetime being a very unpleasant person to people causing them pain, one blessing is not going to remove your pain. It's very simple math. So you have to open your mind to realize that in order to reverse a significant condition, you need to do significant practice, significant forgiveness practice. The Tao Hands blessings, any of the blessings that come through any of the master teachers, the Tao Hands healers, any of the centers, any of the blessings that come through 
any of Master Shah's certified uh, healers, certified practitioners, <clears throat> they all have the ability to remove negative energies. They all have the ability to add to your Akashic records positive virtue, good karma. The more of that you add, the more of the suffering will disappear. So the blessings facilitate a faster return to health. You can do all this on your own. You just have to do a lot more forgiveness practice because what does forgiveness practice do? It releases the negative debt. What does good service do? It adds good karma, which helps release the negative debt. So you can do all this on your own. The, the Tao hands and any blessings from any of the, of the uh, practitioners who have received these transmissions through Master Shah have, uh, have the ability to assist you to accomplish these things faster. Okay? All right, so welcome Dan, welcome Lisa, welcome Zizi, <clears throat> welcome um, Brandy. Now I do encourage all of you, if you have significant health issues, you can contact me directly. I am, right now I'm supporting Master Shah's Tao Healing Center to go there to receive these blessings two hours Saturday, two hours Sunday. Very affordable. Um, I offer even higher level blessings so individually if you're in a position where you can afford a little more honor fee and you, you want direct blessings it can make a significant difference for you you can contact me directly through Facebook Messenger but today's is to share with you about how you can do things very very reasonably and learn more about Tao Hands and hopefully you will open your heart and mind enough to want to become a Tao Hands practitioner yourself for the purpose of serving others because when you can offer blessings and take your children's pain away and you don't have to go see a doctor and you don't have to give them drugs and you don't have to go to psychologist that's miraculous stuff that's what Dow hands can do for you <clears throat> so it's a pathway of awakening so now I will offer everybody a blessing you can request you don't have to post it it's okay I don't need to see it um, it's nice to see if you want to request the same thing you posted already it would be wonderful to see before I had a, you know an eight and now I'm a you know a three whatever um, this is not for I don't need to see that I know this works this is for your validation it's for everybody else's who's watches this validation Wow Dow hands really works because think about it guys Michelle's pain went from an eight to a three I, I don't even know where Michelle lives you know I have no idea I've never met this person how is it possible that within three minutes her pain goes from eight to a three? How is that possible? There is only one answer. Everything resides at the level of soul. Tao healing is soul healing. Souls are not <clears throat> um, blocked by time and space. The minute I chose, uh, heaven chose her, because I didn't chose her, heaven chose her, I called her soul here. Her soul was right in front of me. Her soul was bowing down, not to me, but to heaven for the opportunity to receive the blessing. I turned on my Tao hands. Heaven comes through, releases portions of the spiritual debt that is originating the source of the blockages. Negativity left, positive energies come in. Her pain went down more than 50%. That is miraculous in anybody's book. That's the power of Tao hands. If you are not interested in becoming a Tao Hands healer by now, you need to listen to this again. Because there's very few people I come across on the planet that wouldn't want to have that kind of ability to serve others and themselves. It's extraordinary. So I hope you attend the October 20 and 21st. Just receive first. Just get lots and lots of blessings very affordably. Then move towards the Soul Mind Body Alignment Retreat in November. Learn more about it. And then if it resonates with you and... If you're qualified by purifying enough, you could become a Tao Hands practitioner. <clears throat> so welcome Heather McNee, welcome Christina Walker, uh, welcome Darlene Oso, and anyone else. Prepare to receive. Wherever you're at, sit up straight. Back away from the back of the chair. Bring your feet flat to the floor, unless you're in a lotus position. Relax your body, relax your shoulders, relax your breath. Bring your thoughts, your heart, your mind, and your breath into your lower abdomen. Relax. Prepare to receive. Gently touch your tongue to the roof of your mouth. Keep it there, nice and relaxed. Visualize golden light in your lower abdomen 
<clears throat> if you have a specific place in your body that you've requested, then you can visualize golden light in that area as well. Prepare to receive. I suggest that while I'm offering these blessings, each of you privately in your own heart and mind ask forgiveness for the suffering that you may have brought upon others in the specific area that you have suffering in. Very simple. If you do it from your heart, you could have a far better uh, result. <clears throat> Dear my Dao hands, love you, Ani, about you. Please turn on. As appropriate, please subdivide. Go to all of those watching this video. One time blessing only. If someone watches this video again, second blessing does not work. One time blessing only. Offer it for their request as appropriate. Do not request more than one thing. You request more than one thing, you get nothing. Make your decision now for one thing only. <clears throat> this Tao Hands blessing for these souls under the conditions presented as appropriate. Start. <clears throat> Please continue to offer this service while everyone does this forgiveness practice. Dear all of those, please repeat this forgiveness practice. Dear all souls, repeat. If I or my ancestors have harmed you, offered wrong thoughts about you, said wrong words, or did unpleasant things to you, in this or any time, especially for the area of request that I have made, then I humbly and sincerely apologize. I am suffering, and I would not wish this suffering upon anybody, but I recognize that for every cause there is an effect. I know that there is a possibility that the suffering I have 
could be because I or my ancestors have brought this same suffering to others. And if we have, from the bottom of my heart, I sincerely apologize and ask most humbly, most sincerely for forgiveness. Please, please forgive me and my ancestors. I deeply, sincerely apologize. To all of the souls, continue to repeat, to all of the souls that have caused my suffering in this or any time, I now recognize you may have reminded me of the suffering I caused you first, and I have been blaming you this whole time. I offer you all my unconditional forgiveness and release you of any spiritual debt you may have with me. Let us all move forward in love, peace, and harmony. <clears throat> See the light coming to your area of request. <laughs> Let us gently bow our heads in gratitude. We thank our beloved Divine Creator. We thank all the beings of light who have offered their blessings through this Tao Hands. We are extremely grateful. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How, how, how? Tao Hands return. Blessing complete. <clears throat> so please share, check in with yourself, move your body. Uh, when you report, this was my problem. I had back pain, it was a nine, now it's a three. I had thumb pain, it was an eight, now it's a what? Whatever your problem was, number before, number after. Obviously, some of you have requested things that won't be measurable right away. I see one of you requested assistance to be a better servant to their clients, to attract new clients. I'm sure that will happen for you as well. Uh, let us know. But I will continue to chat a little bit while I see those posts come in. So I invite all of you to receive more healing. October 20 and 21 for a very, very small honor fee. I don't know, 20, 30, 40, maybe 50. I don't know what it is. It's not that much. You can receive a couple hours of these kinds of blessings. This was five minutes. A couple hours. Do you think that might have a little more positive effect for you? I think so. So even if you're crying about the money, do it anyway. And you can receive it Saturday or Sunday or both. How? You call 808-988-8090. And you tell them that you want to be put on the list to be called back when they get the registration link. <clears throat> this is the first step. So that you realize the power of Tao Han. Open your heart. You do not have to suffer. You do not have to pay over and over and over to receive blessings. You can receive enough of these that could solve your problem. Maybe once it could solve your problem. But if it keeps coming back, that means that the karma is a little high. Regardless, each and every one of you are needed to serve humanity. You know, heaven is looking for souls who want to be able to be a Tao Hands practitioner to serve others. Step one, receive the blessings. Step two, become aware of the value in your world and how you can positively impact your children, your parents, your lover, your husband, your wife, your best friends. You can help them. You can help your best friend's daughter that might be going through significant emotional blockages before you were helpless. If you're a Dahan's practitioner, you turn it on, offer a blessing, she could straighten out and end up going to college and straighten out her whole world because of your Dahan's blessing. This can change lives but it starts with you moving past your own pain. So it starts by going to October 2021. So let's see some of the responses here. <clears throat> let's see, uh, Darlene, 
Thank you, Darlene. She says her back pain was an eight. Now it's down to a two, three. Wow, that's huge. That's like a 60, 75% shift. Thank you, heaven. Thank you, Dao Hands. Thank you, Master Shah. Countless bow downs. Always give gratitude to the source. You know, that's their, that's their love. Do you understand that? Now, this is not, you know, just energy healing, guys. This is heaven's love. Be really clear about that. Heaven loves us so much. They want so much for us to, to end our suffering. But we have to wake up to the source of it. Be authentic in our forgiveness. Heaven loves you. This is heaven's virtue, heaven's love to offset this pain. Make sure you are grateful. Deborah Anderson, her pain was an eight down to a four. Now it's a two. Awesome. That's fabulous. Congratulations. Another 75, 80% result. Shelly says, thank you. You're very welcome. I don't need to thank you guys. Thank, thank heaven. Uh, Michelle Taylor, she received the first blessing, went from an 8 down to a 3-4, now it's down to a 1, and she says she feels embraced by much energy. Such a huge, huge, huge positive response. This is, you know, that's miracle stuff, really, guys. Think about it. How many times you tune into a video and, and pain goes down 75-80% in just a few minutes? That's not a normal experience, I can assure you. And so, I encourage you, learn more about Dao Hands. Receive first. Uh, follow the post. Look for Kristen Rojas' post. She's listed the, the phone numbers, the accounts, the days, the times. She may list it again. And then call the uh, center, 988-8, excuse me, the uh, area code is 808-988-8090. doesn't matter if you're in other parts of the world uh, because it's, I think both of these are in the mornings. Uh, like 10 30 or 12 so it's going to meet almost everybody's time zone no matter where they're at in the world uh, they'll be able to tune in and even if you're not able to go there it's recorded so you can watch and receive the blessings later so the key is to register okay um, you are very welcome darla and shannon says it's a miracle uh, it's it is a miracle really it's heaven's love for us and we have to make sure that we are grateful for it so I am very grateful to each and every one of you for attending. Please share this video, even though you won't be able to watch it again to receive blessings more than once. You can watch it again for the wisdom and other people can receive. And when they watch this, even if it's 30 days later, they will receive a healing. It's important for you to understand that. I did this uh, on a recorded TV show that did not show for 30 days after I recorded it. And a woman came to the center saying, I am here because my foot pain is gone that had been there for eight months from a five-minute blessing you offered. She didn't know I wasn't live. She thought I was live. But it was 30 days later. Uh, the blessing goes with the video. Why? Because heaven's doing it. I'm not doing anything. That's the power of Tao healing. This is an extraordinary, extraordinary opportunity. So I encourage you to learn more. I love you. I thank you. I thank you for your sharing, and I will see you all Thursday morning, 9 a.m. Hawaii time. That's three hours earlier than today's live stream. Come. I don't know what I'll be talking about, but I'm sure it'll be fun, whatever it is. So we'll see you then, and make sure you check Kristen's post. She's got the information you need to, uh, to learn more about today's results. All right? Bye-bye, everybody. Yes, anybody you want can watch this, Shannon. Anybody. Share with everybody. Bye-bye.